In this video, we're going to be walking you through the front end of the new Metro News website. As you can see, we are at uh, our development address. Once we go live, this will just be wmetronews.com, as you'd expect. Um, here at the top, we have our high school football uh, scores ticker. Um, this is controllable in the back end. Um, these, uh, these games will it'll stop as you mouse over it, and if you click that, it'll take you to the uh, football scores page and give you a, a table layout of all the scores. Here we have uh, our main navigation, uh, the main sections of news, sports, shows, and outdoors. And you'll notice when we're at the home page, we're actually starting off in the news category. We don't have a true home page. We decided that when the person first comes to the site, they'll be taken straight to the news section. So as we scroll down, we have our main featured story right here. Nice big graphic here. Link to the full story. Also, this is all clickable. Um, this will make more sense uh, once you see the back end, but the naming structure for these, we're going to call this lead one. This will be lead two. This is lead three. This is lead four. And as we go down, we have lead five, lead six, lead seven, and lead eight. All these will need images, what we call a featured image, which will then be cropped by the software to these various sizes for our thumbnails. Then as we scroll down farther, we have more news articles. These are listed in by order of date that they are published. And these articles show up whenever they are checked to be in the news category. You'll also see that once we look at the back end. Scroll down a little farther, we have a link to go to more news, which will then give us a uh, kind of a calendar breakdown of articles that are not currently on the front page. As you can see, we have we've broken them out by day. We also have a uh, kind of a calendar view where you can view uh, news articles by specific dates. Okay, if we go back to the home page, the next uh, section have is the sports section. When you click this, a drop-down menu appears. It gives you your various uh, sports subcategories. We have our Marshall, WVU, high school, and the various high school links. This, let's just go to WVU. So this is what our sports page looks like. The Marshall page's layout is exactly the same, just obviously it says Marshall across the top. Kind of a branding banner there. Uh, for the sports sections, You'll be able to control which, which stories show up where by selecting, again, the, the lead system. So this in this case, this is our lead one, or our L1 story. This is our L2. This here is our L3. We have L4, L5, L6, L7. And again, these, these articles are articles that have also been tagged in the WVU Sports, but are were either not selected to be a lead story or are older than one of these lead stories. And same system as news, we have more sports and it'll give you a uh, breakdown by date. Okay, go back up to sports, I'll show you the Marshall page real quick. As you can see, it's the layout's the same as the, uh, as the view page. And you'll notice these graphics here are showing up. That is, uh, what our fallback is if an image, if a story has been posted without an image. But ideally we think, uh, ideally we'll want to have actual graphics for all these articles. Okay, if we move on, we have our shows page. This is a page, this is going to be kind of our landing page for all of our various shows and all of our video content. So here we have graphics for all our various shows and you can mouse over and get more information as well as the uh, show time. Scroll down, see the full list of shows. And if I go back up to the top, let's take a look at the talk line. Okay, this will uh, show us the Bright Cove video player. This is replacing our vMix system. Um, these videos will all automatically be added to this playlist by adding video in Brightcove to there's there's a talk line playlist, uh, there's also you know sports line playlist, etc. 
So once you add it to that playlist, it will automatically show up in this player. You can also upload just audio clips to the uh, to Brightcove system, and there's an audio playlist as well. So once you add the latest Talkline uh, MP3 to the uh, audio playlist, that will show up in this player. Um, we're going to have uh, iTunes podcast functionality that will also happen automatically based on files being added to a particular playlist. Same with these download links. And as we go down, we have some descriptions of the shows and um, the uh, broadcasting affiliates with links to the various uh, radio sites. Okay, let's move on. We'll go to the outdoors page. Similar layout to some of our, uh, our other news pages. Um, for the outdoors page, this is the outdoors lead or L1. This is L2. This is L3. And again, these are stories that have been tagged in the outdoors category. There's also another category for uh, outdoor journal. There's a uh, page for the trophy room. And then we have a player for the uh, country red show. Again, this will automatically be generated as videos are added to that playlist in Brightcove. Twitter feed on the right. Okay. We also have a uh, videos page. This is going to be kind of our repository for work. all of our various shows. Um, this kind of mimics our uh, shows page in the sense the player loads here. But we have all of our various playlists here, which correspond with our shows. Let's get game night, various episodes here. And we have a little drop down to show a full list of shows. We also have a category called Video Library. And this is kind of the repository of clips that aren't specifically a show, things like player interviews. We also would expect that uh, these player interviews, although you know they're in the video library, uh, would also be in uh, news articles, be featured in news articles. Okay. We also have some just kind of informational pages that are more just static pages about Metro News. There's the advertisement video, some information about about Metro News. Our people page, this is the uh, various uh, contributors. Okay, have some information, some contact information. Uh, if we go back, uh, the Hoppies page also, this will show um, recent posts that have been written by uh, this author. Okay, contact us page, pretty straightforward. Contact form, some information, Facebook feed, things like that. And then also in the footer, we have uh, some other links, you know, advertise with us, privacy policy, th policy, things like that, links to the affiliates internet. Also, we have uh, links that float here at the bottom for the latest newscast, uh, sports and news newscasts. Uh, Again, this, this will happen automatically based on adding the file in Brightcove and putting it in the proper playlist. These open up in a new window. Play it like this. Okay. Close that, it's not loading. But. Okay, we go back to the home page. A couple other things I'll show you real quick. Um, we have a photo gallery feature built in. So whenever you are writing a story, if you upload multiple photos to that story, it'll automatically put the photos into this photo gallery system. You go click through all these, you can click it and get a light box type view next to them. Um, there's also an option if you just want to embed the photos in the article itself, you can turn off this automatic gallery feature and then control them manually. We also have uh, on these articles 
some uh, share features. Post to Facebook, email the link, things like that. We have uh, this related article section. This is automatically generated um, based on the content, story title, things like that. And over here we have a most popular list. This also is automatically generated based on the number of clicks over the past three days. Also, we'll have we have a few widget areas like this, um, some links to uh, Hoppy's commentary articles. Keep you all see those kind of in our day by day uh, list that we use for the uh, news articles as well. Uh, we also have a uh, standard search functionality. Search and it'll bring up a nice view of articles with your search term highlighted. Go back to the uh, home page. Right now, while we're in development, we have a link to the uh, mobile site. This will likely only show up if you have visited the site on a mobile device and then click to view the full site. This will be a link to go back to the mobile view if you uh, don't like the full site view on your mobile device. And I think that covers it. In our next video, we'll be talking about the uh, back end system and how to actually write these articles.